Welcome to Quick Bites. It's in the world here making five star dishes in Cooking Simulator. Today we're going to be tackling the lemon tart. So this is a fairly simple recipe, but I've got a few tips and tricks to hopefully speed up the process. First thing we're going to do is we're going to take a tart and we're going to put that in the oven and bake it for 40 seconds. So this is a little interesting you can't actually put it on a baking tray. If you try, it will just pass right through it. The only way I found to put it in the oven is to use your advanced controls, you know, shift it in and close it that way. So we'll let that bake for 40 seconds. So while that bakes, let's go ahead and get our mixture ready. We're gonna put in the food processors, 180 milliliters of coconut milk, 20 milliliters of honey and five grams of brown sugar. Let's go ahead and see, I'm going to pour it into a bowl. We'll measure it out that way. That way I can use the ladle, we can be exact. Not, oop, there we go, 182. And we're coming up on the 40 seconds, so I'm gonna turn off the oven right about now. So back to the milk, we got 100, 182. Let me taste it a couple times. We're back down to 180. And we can just ladle this into the food processor. Maybe. <laughs> Let's take it off. That seems to be a little easier to maneuver. There we go. Much, much better. Next, we're going to need 20 milliliters of honey. Again, we'll use the bowl method. Ooh, got it on the right first pour. Makes it nice and easy. But this just ensures that we get the right amount the right time. And that way there's no issue in my pouring skills being a deterrent in our score. So this goes on the food processor. We're going to blend this. I've just found turning it on, let it do its thing. That's good enough for me. It says mixture. Perfect. So next we got to cut up some vegetables. We need uh, half a banana. That's 100 grams. Uh, one banana is 200 grams. So you cut that in half, slice it up a few times. Same with the lemon. So this just takes practice. My advice is to start with the banana you know, grab a few, come through and do different slices to see and try and get the right amount. You're looking for 20 gram slices here. I found the bananas pretty difficult. Ooh, we got one right there. You'll find that you'll need to cut it a few times to get the right amount. The lemon on the other hand, you can do thin slices and that seems to work for it. Cause you gotta get 10 slices out of this lemon or eight slices to get the 10 gram slices out. So again, make some slices. You can see it's actually not too bad to get close to 10. And same with the orange. As for the strawberries, you're cutting six strawberries in half. The easiest way to do this, you can throw that into the food processor and this will cut them in half perfectly. So there's no need to grab your knife and slice through these. It's very easy to get like four and six gram pieces. You do it this way, they all end up being five gram pieces. So now that we got all the fruit cut up here, we're gonna assemble. So we're gonna grab our tart. Let's pull that out of the oven. We're going to put 200 milliliters of our mixture in. Let's go ahead and do that right now. Again, we have to, we got to pull the food processor off. I like to live dangerously and put that right next to the edge. That goes in. Grab the last 50 milliliters. And the tart has its mixture in it. And we're going to follow the directions here and assemble as instructed. So we're going to throw the lemons in first. Just drop them right in. 
then the bananas. Yeah, the bananas, then the oranges, and then the strawberries. We got our slices of bananas. The slices of oranges are next. And finally, our strawberries. And this is a tart. Doesn't quite look like the picture, but we're going to serve it cool. I think we should be good to go. Let's see if we get our full five stars. And there you have it. It's a quick and easy recipe. It's easy to do. You can have a lot of that mixture already prepped. You can have a lot of the fruit already sliced up. The strawberries just go through the processor and you get a lot of, you know, you can slice through like 20 lemons and have a stack of them somewhere and you'll be all set to go. Of course, if you're looking for a different variation, I will be coming out with an episode soon on the mango tart. So get subscribed, get excited. We're going to be going through dishes. If there's any dishes you have struggled with getting the full five stars and don't know why you haven't, let me know those down in the comments below and we'll take a look at them in future episodes. Otherwise, thanks for watching as I simulate my life one game at a time. If you enjoyed this episode, please be sure to hit subscribe so you don't miss any of the future action. You can follow on Twitter for updates to future games being played, as well as follow on Twitch, as I'll occasionally stream live. Thanks, and I'll see you next time at Sim the World.